you talk to us about the history of contraception, how it's evolved and where we, to where we are now? So birth control has been around for as long as there has been mm -hmm. sex. Um, so if you think about this back about 3000 BC, so this is 3000 years before Christ, um, they were using many things such as vinegars, lemons, um, the intestines of animals to create condoms. Um, so there were many numerous things that, that people used. There were actually even almost witchcraft people that were very well trained regarding leaves and plants and um, things that they would insert in certain parts of the body right. to prevent pregnancy or even medications that they would take to prevent pregnancy. Um, so that's many, many years ago. So then fast forward to what would we, we would call more modern times. Um, in the 1800s is when we start seeing true condoms being created, condoms um, <clears throat> and diaphragms. Of course, imagine you, well, you don't go to a store and buy these things. Right. You would have one condom, and that was the one that you used with all your sexual encounters. Um, so, and then fast forward a little bit further, and in, in the United States, um, the history of birth control is very interesting. So back in about 1873, we had the Comstock Act, which um, basically prohibited the discussion, the creation, the selling, the education of any types of birth control products. So everything was hush-hush. Wow. <clears throat> so it was like a black market of birth control. It was, it, it definitely was. <laughs> and if people wanted to discuss birth control, it had to be either behind closed doors or it had to be for other reasons, okay? For menstrual irregularities or something like that.